Today we ask what's stopping you. We all say we're going to write a book, run a marathon or work for a charity, but we don't. We put it off till next week, next month, next year. Well, we're about to meet someone who, unlike the rest of us, has made that brave step towards a new life. So Rachel, can you tell me what your job is now? Yep, yeah, so here at Oxfam I'm the Head of Marketing Intelligence and my team look at researching the way the general public in the UK think about Oxfam, how they would like to support us, what they'd like to know about us in the future and we build our strategy for communicating with the UK public based on that research. And what were you doing before? So before I worked for Oxfam, I worked in marketing for a big multinational company. I lived in Geneva. It was quite a stressful life. I had to work really long hours for something I didn't really enjoy. And were there any specific triggers that prompted you to change your career? There was one specific event. There was a growing sense of really not feeling very satisfied with just selling products that were making money for shareholders. But then in 2007, I went to the Live 8 concert in London, so big event to raise awareness around poverty and injustice in Africa. And that just felt like an amazing event. Lots of people coming together, lots of attention focused on issues that I really cared about. And there was a real sense of optimism that we could change things. And I just thought, I want to be part of something like this that's big and important and really means something.